Did you know that Amazon receives consistently over 2 billion visitors every single month? That's over 8.5 million every single day. Amazon is one of the biggest e-commerce platforms and in this video I'm going to show you how you can actually promote products here, affiliate products using YouTube Shorts. And Amazon actually has an affiliate program, it's called Amazon Associates. So they allow you to promote their products. The only problem with the Amazon is that the commissions are actually low compared to most affiliate networks or affiliate programs but that doesn't mean that you can make profit that you can make money here you can still make really good money here if you promote the products the right way okay and there's no better way to do it than using shorts shorts is a powerful platform that you can use to promote affiliate products as you can see all these are shorts these are short videos specifically promoting gadgets and as you can see the number of views that they're getting 4.3 million views this is 21 million views here we have 34k 1.4 million views so these videos get a lot of views here and you can do a similar thing promoting Amazon products. So this is going to be another valuable step-by-step -step tutorial. Just be sure to hit the like button and subscribe to the channel. Now the first thing that you want to do is to sign up to Amazon Associates. You can get to this website by typing Amazon Associates on Google. Just Google Amazon Associates or just type affiliate-program.amazon.com. Okay, and then you click on sign in. And once you have signed up, you're going to have a bar at the top looking like this. Okay, this is their Amazon side stripe. Now this bar allows you to promote any product over here. Okay, let's say I want to promote um, a fire stick, a fire stick device, or maybe just this device over here that I was looking at. So I'll click on this, which will take you to the product page. And then you're going to click on this bar over here. You're going to click on text. Okay, and then this here is going to be your Amazon affiliate link. All right, so this is how I can promote this product using this affiliate link over here. Okay, now the type of products that you would like to promote here on Amazon are highly such products. Okay, and these products you can find them under best sellers. So these are all the best selling products here on Amazon. Now, what personally I would do and what I recommend that you promote are gadgets. Gadgets really get a lot of attention. You can look for them in best sellers in electronics. Okay, here's where I'm going to find the gadgets. So we have this uh, the Apple AirTag, you have the Amazon Fire Stick. You have the Apple AirPods, okay, and then you can click here to see more. So these here are the most popular products in the electronics department here on Amazon. Another way that you can look for gadgets here on Amazon are new tech gadgets, okay. These are gadgets that are new. People have not yet seen these gadgets or maybe very few people have seen these gadgets. And these are the kinds of gadgets that you want to promote. So you can come up over here on the search bar and then just type maybe new, new tech. Okay, new tech gadgets. All right. So these are the products over here that you would like to promote. And as you can see, the prices, which means the higher the price, the more commissions that you are going to make. Okay. Now you want to be careful. You don't want to promote something that's very expensive. You really don't want to go beyond maybe something like $500. So something below $500 is what you really want to promote. Like these, you can promote these, you can promote these over here. Okay. You can scroll down further. You can see. They have this cell phone stand with wireless Bluetooth speaker and anti sleep, and it has a base HD surround sound, which is perfect for home and outdoors. So, this is also really catchy. You can promote this, it's a, it's a very good price. It's only that the commissions will be low. And then, here you have this mini projector. These mini projectors are very, very popular. You can actually project movies on a wall, they're really on demand. And as you can see, they have a five star review over here. So, these are the kind of products that you want to promote on youtube shorts okay so i'm going to use this one here as an example um this one here the mini projector i'm going to open this and what you really want to look for here are video clips sometimes they have video clips um this one actually does have a video over here so you can open this now sometimes amazon allows you to download the video uh, in this case i don't think i can download this one uh, let me see if i right click and click on save okay this is a web page so i cannot download so what you want to do is to create your own video for this product using images, okay? And images that you can use are these over here. As you can see, we have these. You can also use these. You can use these. Okay, it's just these images here that the, that you can use. And sometimes you can get more images from the website. Okay, so you can visit the website, which is a fat store. I don't know if they have a website. Sometimes they do, but you can look for it on Google. Let's just type. Uh, let's copy this. Head over to Google. You can paste and search. So 
All right, so it seems like they have, which is this one here. Let's open this. All right, and as you can see, they actually have a website, and this is the product itself. Okay, now you can also find the video from here. Let's see if they have the video and if we can download it. Uh, okay, so I don't think they have a video. So we are going to look for images. So they have this image, they have this the back view, they have this one here, person holding it. Okay, you can also use these images. This image is also important because it shows the uh, features. So it's a 1080p DLP, uh, 7000 milliamp. All these are details that you can use. You also have this here. We have this as well. This is a good one because it shows that you can actually go camping and use the projector. All right. So since we're already here, we, what we're going to do is to download these images. I'm going to open the first one. I'm going to see if I can download this. Okay, this is a web file. Uh, that's fine. You can open it in a new tab. Okay. And then we can actually snip it. Okay. So I'm going to snip this just like this. Click on save. Okay. Let's uh, snip another one. Um, this one here. Okay. This is the back view. Open in a new tab. Okay. Sometimes the snipping is not necessary. If they allow you to save without having to go through this process, you can actually just save it. This as well. Open in a new tab. I'm also going to snip these two images. All right. So I am done. Again, you can look for more images um, just around the website. You can also use an image like this. This is a really cool looking image. Okay. But for now, I'm just going to leave it like this. Now that we have our images, we have found the product to promote. We have downloaded the images. Now what we're going to do is to bring them together into a video. So we're going to be using Canva. This is canva.com. And what you're going to look for here is mobile video. You're just going to type over here, mobile video. All right, click on that. Scroll down, just click on the first one, a blank one. You will then be taken to this blank white canvas. So what we're going to do now is to upload our images. All right, we're going to now upload them from our folder. I'm just going to copy all of these. Okay, drag them to Canva like this. All right, so now I'm going to just click on the first one and then now I'm just going to expand it like this. Okay, here it really just depends on how you want to do it. It doesn't have to be this big, so I can just uh, undo it and even just make it the way it was. Just that size is fine. And then as you can see here, you have the duration of this frame, okay, of this video, which is actually five seconds. So you can actually play it from here. And as you can see, it's going to play that whole frame. So what we're going to do now, we're going to add another page or another image. Okay, I'm going to click on the second image, which was the back view, something like that. I'm just going to do the same for the rest of them. Okay, something like that. Click on the next one. Now this is going to show the features. Now again, if you still want to use this, uh, the product image itself, you can find more images from Amazon. They should be having some images at the bottom, at the bottom here. Uh, let's see. You can also use some of someone holding it. Um, okay, so I don't think they have more images. All right, so again, you have the same image here. So you can open this, okay, and then you can also snip it. All right, you can close that. You can come back to Canva. Okay, now I can remove this one here. Let's upload our new image. Okay. Let me bring it up a little bit. And let me show the one with the tent. Okay, I'm just going to do the same thing. From here, it's just a repeat process. So what we want to do now is to add some animations to our image. Okay. I'm going to start with the first one. And then I'm going to click on animate over here. And as you can see, Canva has tons of different animation uh, styles. You have the simple. You have the sleek. Okay, so you can go ahead and just test them out. Okay, I really like the party. And then you have this as well. Okay, so it just depends on uh, the type of animation that you wish to, uh, to use. So I'm just going to select party. Okay, and then for the second one, I can select another one. Okay, maybe the chill or uh, let's see the rise. Okay, let me select rise. And then for the next one, I'll choose something else. I'll just choose the fade. And then for this one, 
okay maybe slick and then lastly for this one uh maybe simple okay so now we can go ahead and play them all right so that looks cool so now what we're going to do is add some text we're going to add some text describing the product okay let me start with the first one i'm just going to drag our product up there okay and then i'm going to click on text over here and then you can use any of these and also you can use the pre-made templates over here so i'm just going to use this one here the free delivery i'm just going to drag it down over here all right so we're going to get more information for the product description on amazon so let's head over to amazon okay here we can say a fatok mini projector is a 5g dlp smart portable movie projector okay I'm going to copy that come back here actually i'm going to use something smaller let me just use uh, this one here all right and then i'm going to highlight all this and paste it there okay copy all this let me change the text color to black okay, because our background is white and also you can change the font if you don't like that you can also select that you can change the font from here uh, maybe i can select the monster art classic I'm going to edit this and say a photo mini projector okay is a 5G let's make this smaller okay it's a 5G Wi-Fi DLP smart portable movie projector right so let's play that again all right and then for the next one we're just going to do pretty much the same thing we're going to come back to Amazon and here we can say it's a pocket monster outdoor projector for phones okay i can copy this i can just use the same text over here i copy this come back here and then i paste it there all right so i'm going to highlight all this let's come again back to amazon all right paste it there okay so it says pocket monster outdoor projector for phones so we can say it's a pocket it's a pocket monster for phones and then we can add up to 1080p because that was also there up to 1080p so this is pretty much how you can do it let's go to the next one let's go back to amazon okay we can get more information here we can just copy this okay come back here and control v and then from here on you can just now add the features of the product let's come back again uh, let me let me copy this before i i repeat the same thing okay let's come back again to amazon okay so all these features here you can go and actually copy them so let me just copy one or two more which is this one here come back here okay highlight all this and paste it there okay i'm going to copy that for the next slide and then paste it there okay so here you can talk about camping since it's, uh, it already has a picture of someone here camping uh, let's see if amazon has said anything about camping um okay so they haven't said anything about camping but we can add that ourselves let's just come back over here so we can say something like best for outdoor and camping okay so as you can see guys this is just very simple you're pretty much just getting description from amazon because every information is just available from amazon the product itself is available from amazon the features and the descriptions are all there so now we can go ahead and test let's test the first one from the first one okay so i'm just going to pause it there because it's really boring without music we need to add music so we're going to click on we're going to scroll down here we're going to click on audio and here you can use there are audios now i'm on the free version and the free version has very limited but you can just go ahead and use them so we have this one here okay you have this one all right so you can just select any of them i'm just going to drag okay to select your audio just drag it to the video timeline below here just like that just use the cursor over here okay and then now you can drag your audio okay just like that now it will automatically match the end of the video all right so now we can go ahead and test it right 
So that is pretty much how you would do a short video. And as you can see, the full duration of the video here is 25 seconds, which means you can go ahead and add more seconds to your video. Just make sure you don't go beyond 60 seconds. Now, once you're done with that, you also want to add a call to action button, okay, which is going to tell them to click the link in the description. Okay, so we're going to add another page, click on that, and then we're going to click on text here. Now, you can use the same format that you're using. I'm just going to use this one here, and then I'm just going to highlight all this and tell them to click link in the description. Or I can just say link in the description for more details. Okay, so link in description for more details. You can also animate this if you want, but I'll just leave it like that for now. So we have a full duration, which is 30 seconds, all right? Now, once you're done with your video, you can now save it. Just click on share, okay, download MP4 video, click on download. All right, so now that we have our video downloaded, we can now upload it to YouTube, okay? That will be our last step. So let's head over to YouTube. You just click on upload over here, upload video, just drag your video over here and then now you can enter the details you can enter the title so you can give it the name of the product you can say maybe a uh, best mini projector best mini projector we can also get the product name so let's come back to amazon okay so it was called fat fork mini projector or fat Oak, sorry fat Oak mini projector okay come back here and then paste it there you can then separate the two just like that. Okay, you can add more information if you want, but this is fine. And then you have your description over here. Now here is where you can add the affiliate link of the product, okay, your Amazon affiliate link. So let's come back to Amazon. Again, you're going to click on this text over here, and then you're going to click on this link. Okay, just copy that, come back over here, and then just paste your affiliate link over there. You can add more information if you want. If you want to add further information about the product, you can go ahead and do that. All right. Once you're done with the description, you can scroll down over here. Um, here's where you're now going to add your tags. Okay. Now we can get our tags in different places. And one of the best places that you can get it is from Chat GPT. Okay. Now I have this extension called AIPRM Chat GPT prompts. It has thousands of prompts. So we're going to look for YouTube tag over here. So I'm just going to search YouTube tags. Okay, and the one that we want is this one here, YouTube tags. Okay, so just click on this, and then we're going to enter our keyword, which is mini projector. Click on enter. All right, now as you can see, these are the tags that we can use for our YouTube video. Okay, so we can copy the first one over here. Okay, just like that, come back here, and then just paste it there. Come back again to our tags. Okay, so you're just going to do this for all of them. Come back here and paste it. So as you can see, this is a very, very powerful um, extension that comes with thousands of prompts and it's called AIPRM. You can download it from the Chrome Web Store or you can just find it on my website, which is robertokello.com. Go to AI extensions, click on chat GPD Chrome extensions. You are going to find it here. It's actually the first one on the page. So it's called AIPRM for chat GPT. You're going to click on download a PRM extension. Okay, it's a very, very powerful Chrome extension that you need to be using with Chat GPT. So once you're done with your YouTube tags, you're just going to continue with your normal procedures. You're going to click on visibility and then you're going to click on public and click on publish. Okay, now mine is grayed out because I haven't submitted this step over here. Click on none of the above and submit rating. Now, this is only for when you have already a thousand subscribers. It's for the monetization, but if you have less than a thousand subscribers, you're not going to have this step over here, which is fine. So once you're done, you're just going to head over to visibility, click on public, and now click on publish. All right, guys. Now, if you want to learn how to get video traffic, you know, video traffic for YouTube Shorts, check out this video over here, where I show you some of the best video sources that you can use for free traffic. Thanks for watching. See you on the next one.